Just about everybody's heard of Nike and Under Armour, global brands, but still entrenched in their hometown. It's the same road map a Syracuse apparel company is using now. As it grows nationally from roots made in central New York. Mark Jones was a football star, CBA, University of Tennessee, before eventually playing pro ball in Germany, where he became a household name, and why he was approached with a business deal some years ago. And I'm like, wow, that'd be different and unique. I'm going to have my own brand. But that deal fell through and sparked a new one, starting his own apparel business, Dreisig. It's German for 30, his football number. I came up with a business plan. And I said, let me see what happens after five years and see where I am in five years. So now we're 19 years later, and we're still doing it. Dreisig line features a little bit of everything, but that wasn't enough for Mark Jones. He branched out to uniforms, selling to teams across the U.S., thanks in part to some of his former Tennessee teammates and their advice on what teams were looking for. But we evolved for the better, mm. and now we have these different segments and we have these different lines. Like branching out his screening and embroidery operation in Syracuse for sports teams to include corporations and then government agencies and departments. Nothing at all like his next idea. Hatched while cheering on his beloved Tennessee Volunteers in the college softball World Series. But I'm instantly in my mind, I said, if you're going to clap, you got to make some noise. You're not making any noise. Huh, wonder if I had the football gloves on. Yeah. But instead of the leather to catch the ball and grip the ball on the inside, I went ahead and I replaced that leather with plastic. <laughs> And fan hands were born, quickly selling across the country. Colors for whatever team you root for, and more loudly now. Fan hands are on the verge of a big licensing deal with who else? The University of Tennessee. For me, it's a dream come true if we can get into the University of Tennessee, because Tennessee is going to start it off, and then it should be the domino effect after that. And in the works, a line of sneakers, so Dreising can outfit teams head to toe. But you want to make sure that it's durable, it's functional, and then it's comfortable yeah. for that person that's wearing the shoe. And, that's the and then this is the key. Yeah. So this is the key, and I really don't want to explain what it is, but this is the key aspect to it, and this is why yeah. the Dreising shoes are always going to be different from the yeah. other brand yeah. shoes. Mark Jones had made a name for himself on the field, and now he's doing it for his companies in the business world. So we're creating this brand to go ahead and, and be a national brand, but based right here out of Syracuse, New York. So how can you not cheer him on? Jeff Kulikowski, News Channel 9. Now, Dreisig has developed a tight collaboration with the design program at Casanova College. Students there are working on Mark's next project, a line of apparel aimed specifically at college students. I'm going to get some of those gloves. Okay. <laughs> Coming up tonight.